what's up family we're back welcome to the dreamer brand channel alex zasso back on your screen if you're new to the channel please consider subscribing turning on your post notifications giving this video a like so you can help us boost the youtube algorithm and also go copy merch first link in the description guys today we got another good topic for you get that cargo okay this is back to building the empire tomorrow we got a few meetings to talk to a few designers just good things are happening. I'm excited, guys. I'm excited. But let's talk about the topic real quick. Your dream is gonna require sacrifice. That's pretty much plain and simple. Any dream you have in life will require sacrifice. And what do I mean by that, guys? Because we see, we all are human beings. Okay, so we all have our desires. We all have our wants. We all have our uh, comforts that we want to live with in life, right? But see, let me ask you. Where is that going to take you? How far is that going to take you? We have to sacrifice a few things in life and we're not willing to do it. But if we have a dream, a vision, a goal of where we're headed, we got to do it. Okay, so what can you sacrifice? Number one, sacrifice time with your friends that is not useful to your dream. Number two, sacrifice spending money, buying the things that you like. That way you have more money to invest in your business. And trust me, in 2020, I was guilty of not sacrificing some of those things. And that's why I believe after analyzing my business, we're not as big or we probably haven't gone as far as we wanted to go. But that's because of me. I was guilty of it. So I want to inspire you to sacrifice all that, guys. Sacrifice two to five years. That's all it takes, two to five years to work on your dream, to build your empire, to build a future that you want for you, yourself, your family. And once you do that, then you can live the life that you want to live. See by that, your business. Number three, sacrifice. Downtime. Two to three years, sacrifice downtime with your friends, your family. Number four, sacrifice your family, meaning if they call you for an event, if whatever they have going on, if they call you for you to be there to show up, sacrifice, tell them I'm working, I'm hustling, I'm grinding, I'm building my empire, guys. And number five, sacrifice. Opportunities that may give you quick money for an opportunity to build an empire, okay? So let me explain a little bit more in detail in terms of that. See, sometimes there's a work opportunities that gives us faster money, maybe starting like a, another side business or uh, going to work for a few hours or a few days just to get some quick cash. We can do it once in a while, but not all the time, guys. We have to sacrifice that as well. Minimize that time that we do that. You know why? Because that time is only going to get us addicted to making the money and going to work. And then we're going to start slowly forgetting our dream. What is our passion? What is our overall vision for the future for our lives? So you have to minimize that and sacrifice a lot of that. Just know, have faith in God. Have faith in your dream. Have faith in what you do and know that if you sacrifice the time, if you put in the effort, if you put in the passion behind what you do, okay, then pretty soon you're going to start living and reap. There's a saying, okay, there's a saying that says you reap what you sow. So if you reap that in terms of sacrifice, hard work, dedication, effort, then that's going to pay off in the end, guys. So those are the five things that we have to sacrifice to achieve our dream. Dreamerapparel.online for sync and description. I almost crashed, guys. Okay, crazy, what is he doing? Yeah, so... Because that's the only way. If we just decide to sacrifice, we make a decision, okay? To sacrifice, to put in the effort, to work, to dedicate ourselves, to do what we want to do and follow our dream then eventually it will happen. Okay, because let me also give you an example. I saw a quote today, okay, of Usain Bolt. He said, I trained for four years to win a nine second race. I trained for four, four years to win a nine second race, guys. And what did he, he won a gold medal. He won millions of dollars. 
So what does that say to you? It tells you about persistence. It tells you about patience. It tells you about dedication. And it tells you about effort. Some people are tired after one, two, three months. Maybe a year, the longest, and they quit. But this guy trained for four years to win a gold medal and to win millions of dollars. So what does that tell you? The time that you have to put into your craft. Let's go guys. Two mile run, let's go. Never quit, don't quit. People say they don't got time. People say they don't money. And people say they don't have the right resources. You know what I say to them? That's a lie. Why? Because you always have time. You just have to know how to manage and prioritize your time for whatever is important for you. They don't have money? Why? Because they're not working. They don't know how to make more money apart from work. How to build something that brings you income. They don't have the resources. Another lie. Why? They're not creative. They don't know how to find and get those resources that they need. That's it. So let's go. Go make it happen. Never stop, never quit. Your dream is there for the take. Hashtag dream. We're here to inspire you guys. Let's go. Got off work. But take a look at this. This is the entrance to the gym. You know what many will say? Whatever, I'm gonna go home. But guess what? You gotta be creative. When you really want it, you gotta make it happen somehow, somewhere, right? Look what we got. We got this thing right here. We're about to do some squats, some push-ups, some leg raises, and get this workout in, guys. Cause we're committed, let's go. What's up? Happy Thursday. In the middle of the work, I just want to stop for a minute and just uh, analyze and, and inspire you guys. Based on the situation that happened yesterday in DC, on the riots, the people attacking the Capitol building, destroying all the raids with violence and weapons, and fighting against something that it's conspiracy, things that are not relevant to our lives, especially us dreamers. What we have to do guys, we have to be inspired. Just like they are fighting for what they want, whether it's bad, we have to be that way. We have to take shots, we get them every day. Knock down all the challenges, obstacles, hardships that we're going through our lives and just use that force, use that power, that willpower that God gave us to go after a dream every day, guys, okay? So, forget about what's going on there. Don't let it affect you and just envision the dream that you have for life, for yourself, for your family, for your future, and go make it happen, guys. I'll see you at the top. Remember our motto, create the vision, live the dream. If you haven't joined the movement, I encourage you to join a movement of inspiration. And if you have, I appreciate you guys. So much love, God bless.